Say so guys, I just got in from school and I'd like to answer a few questions which I've been asked personally and have been left on comments for the past, well within the last two weeks of videos. I just want to answer a few of them because they've been asked a ton. Let me answer them now. The thing is, I'm not sure who's answered these, this is just coming off the top of my head, ones I remember because I can't bother to get to my computer because now it's vlogging time. So, the questions I can remember I'm just going to talk about. So Kian, when are you going to be doing a 4K vlog? Today. Today, I'm doing a 4K vlog. This is going to be a bit of a shorter vlog than normal. And do you like the 4K? How does it look? I think the focusing goes off a bit in 4K. If it's a lot better, we'll stick with 4K. But these are the shorter vlogs. You're going to have a 16 gb SD card in here. And normally in 1080p, I have about 2 hours of recording. But in 4K, I have 14 minutes and 30 seconds. So today's vlog will have to be a short one, but comment down below how a 4K looks. Someone asked me why I do so many Bitcoin videos. I do so many Bitcoin videos, one because they pay extremely well, and number two, I basically earn the equal amount which I'm making from my YouTube videos a month. I make the same amount in Bitcoin. Like from the videos I've done on Bitcoin stuff, there's always a referral link in the description. If you click that and sign up and use the website, I get some percentage, it's only like 20 to 40 percent depending on the website. And that's equal amount to what I earn from all my YouTube videos, which funds this whole vlogging setup and everything, basically my room related to tech. That's why I do so many Bitcoin videos, sorry it's a bit annoying. And someone today at school asked me, Kian, when are you next opening a pass on your vlog? Well that turns out to be today. I have no idea what's in it. I've, yes, I've opened it. That's just because I didn't know if it's for me or not. It says my name on the first thing I saw in there, so... Let's just have a look at this parcel now. I'm so excited to open this. But I think I know what company it's from, but not what's in there. Complete surprise. One. Oh no. Like, uh, Kian, you could have just uh, caught them a bit better. First up, we have a 10,000 milliamp power bank. Next up, we have a braided lightning cable. And lastly, we have a aluminium bumper case. Thanks for this, it looks pretty cool, that, 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 that might actually look quite cool on my iPhone. Okay, so I'm not being funny to the company who make this case but seriously your clear case came with like dust and dirt in it I'm not sure if you can even pick it up on this camera but if I put the right lens on there like my f1.7 there's like dust and dirt on it and the bumper case almost broke my phone putting it on I just figured out at the last minute there's a latch on the bottom there to like yeah to turn this case off and on so you can take the bumper off like seriously, what you, who even makes this stuff? Still good. I'm sorry about it. what is going on with focus. 4K. I hate you when you don't want to focus. But um, thanks for the bumper case. Still, still, still good. Still good. We're gonna get that. It looks cool, but it's dirty. I'm gonna have to email the CEO of this company. But sorry, your case is kind of dirty. So I'm just trying out the face detection in 4K. I should keep like a cleaner focus on my face. Anyway, I'm gonna try it and I'll do a really cool Instagram photo because I've actually made a case that like, not have too much dirt on it. Because it, I'm not sure you can see it, but this case was super super dirty on the back. And because I've turned fake strack on, it's dead my face but not on my phone, so that's hard to show, but it had some dirt a while ago. Now it's all clean. Yeah, it's kind of focusing, but you can see in reflection there. There's no horrible dirt. To fix it, all I did was just wash it. So hello guys, how are you doing? I hope you've done well for this vlog. I've just loaded the Instagram picture, which you can see on my Instagram, IKNYT. And I'm going to end the vlog off, just because I don't want to end it here, because I'm doing cool stuff tonight, like making cookies. Well, if, if I can be well, I told my parents I would make them cookies, so I might do that in a minute. But this 4K takes forever. Can you notice any difference? Just checking it is in 4K, and it is. But do you like the look of a 4K? Because to get this 4K to be able to edit, I need to downgrade it to 1080p. And when exporting, export it as 4K and it kind of keeps the same. 
like settings of that because that's what I've done with Final Cut on my Mac. I did it for Protect Me, it's run it today. How was the quality of Mac? Give me some feedback. Hopefully, this vlogging quality is good in 4K. Leave your feedback down below. And once I do one vlog in 4K, I can start to learn like what I need to do to make everything go faster and some more smoother so I can do longer 4K vlogs. But tomorrow, vlogs will resume at 1080p.